Hello and welcome to Crochet Bop. Today I want to show you how to choose the correct hook size for the yarn you have. So the first thing, one of the easiest things to do is just simply look, take your ball of yarn and just look at it. And a lot of them will tell you what you need. So right here, this one here just has knitting needles, but usually you can match up whatever size with the knitting needles. Um, they're similar to your crochet hook. So this one here is four to five, and then it has this US, which is an American, um, knitting needle so size so you could either this here four to five is in millimeters so i have some examples so that's um where you find it on the yarn and then on the hooks you will see um, on one side there's either numbers and sometimes there's letters so this one here um, i bought in europe and so it's in millimeters so 3.5 millimeters so that would match up with any yarn. Sometimes they give ranges. So they'll say like between two and four millimeters. So this hook would work for anything that says that. Um, I have another one that's a little bit smaller. It's kind of hard to see, 2.5 millimeters. So that's what that looks. And then this one here is um, a more distinctly American hook because it has a letter on it. Those letters kind of give you the clue that that's an American one. So F dash five. And that's the size. So sometimes you have those letters. Now, I remember growing up, I think we crocheted about everything with the G hook. And I don't remember numbers even being on them. I used to have quite a stash, but somehow in life I've lost some of them. So um, that is how you match them up. So I will show you a couple different types of yarns because each brand of yarn is different. So this one here, um, it has all these lovely bits of information, but we have one for... Um, knitting needles and then this here you see the picture of a crochet hook and it says between two and four so um that one hook i had right here this one here that's 3.5 is perfect to crochet for this and kind of how i look at it is when you put that yarn in that hook you just see how it fits it's not too fat and too big for that i'll give you an example of one that's this one here is really small and you can just see how it, it does, it just about fills up that whole hook. And it's not as easy to crochet if your hook is too small for your yarn. If it's too big, like say for an example, I have this one here that's quite large. I think it's considered a jumbo hook. Um, then you just have a lot of loose, um, more open holes in your crochet work and it, sometimes that is desirable so it's not always a bad thing so that is how I um, when I go to crochet a project I just look at the label and everyone has their own label so I just look and see okay there's that one here's another this is red heart that's a very familiar yarn so you can look around until you find it and there again it's a size five and here they've mixed both the knitting needles with the crochet hook so it's easy to see on that. So I hope you have found this somewhat helpful for how to get the right size of hook for the yarn you want to crochet with. 